So, so Her Majesty has this thing with the army, I guess. Um, I like to yell. She likes to yell. She likes to fight. She likes to yell more. So we see this quite often that she's out there on the list, yelling away, out there in the field, yelling away. And I don't think the people over here have heard enough of your yelling. So I'm going to come over here so they can hear me for a change. <laughs> oh, I can be louder, Your Majesty. But I, I do think, though, that we might have a problem. You see, I, I look at all these people here. These are great people. We have a new court baron right here. <laughs> <laughs> we have a new Laurel. We have new people that got crazy. We've got Congress for the shenanigans. Oh, what a place. But I think there's some leadership skills here that I see in the audience. I see everything. But I don't think that we recognize it quite yet. I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> your Majesty, I don't know what you're talking about. I know what I need to do. I need to go to one of my knights, one of my knights that's local to me, and ask him about something. Uh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> so, Sir Sonicor, you're here. You understand leadership, but you led, you led regions in our army, didn't you? I have, Your Majesty. Well, you know what it takes to be a leader of our army. I do, Your Majesty. Well, is there something we should do? I do. What, what's that? Well, I have been traveling this spring a great many places. And in that, we elected a new con amongst my people. A con? What? What would this con do? Well, while we were electing this new person, I also got an opportunity to meet with some of my other brothers. And one of them gave me a token. A token. A token that I think would solve your problem. And I am unable to pass it along, so I would ask for you to do the honor. Whoa. I like this token. I think this is a token Her Majesty needs to see first. Your Majesty! <laughs> Sir Silverthorne here. I was here. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure. But I think this token needs to be passed along. <laughs> I think we could do that. Red company, fall away! That's like what you want. Okay. <laughs> right here. I see a great number of red company here. But one thing I don't see enough of is I don't see enough of the next level of leadership. So I think we need to fix that. Morales, <coughs> come up here. <laughs> Look to us for what are they going to do? 
history. There have been many warriors who have fought and led from within the ranks, rising to positions of great honor. Such a one is Leofric of Osprey, and we do today recognize him as a companion of the Order of the Red Company. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> oh. Draco! Hey! 